Hey, what's going on everyone? I appreciate y'all coming here and checking out this Fallout 76 video. In this one, I got you guys a glitch that you're probably going to want to take advantage of before Bethesda patches this out of the game. And yes, Bethesda will be for sure patching this because this is absolutely broken. I'm going to be showing you all how to take out the new bosses super quick. You could easily solo the Storm Goliaths with this glitch. So this will guarantee you three three-star legendaries each time you do this a lot of experience, as well as unique rewards that you get for completing this new boss fight event. So yeah, it's definitely beneficial to use this glitch while it's still in the game. It makes things way easier. Consider leaving a like on this video if you do find this enjoyable. This support is greatly appreciated, everyone. And by the way, before I get into this, I just want to give credit where credit is due. I did not discover this myself. I actually learned this from a Fallout 76 content creator that goes by Angry Turtle. Big shout out to him. He has amazing content over on his channel. If you don't know about Angry Turtle and you play Fallout 76, I highly recommend to go check out his channel. I'll leave a link down below in the description to his channel for you to check out. But yeah, now let's get into this glitch. First things first, I'm just going to show you all gameplay over this in action. Check this out. And then I'll get into how this is done. This is about to be hilarious. How fast can we kill him this time? I'm using the auto axe with overly generous to give me radiation damage. Here we go. Unauthorized access to the facility detected. Authorizing Here we go. <laughs> but this is definitely going to patch this. Oh my gosh. Annihilated. Oh! <laughs> we were pretty much all using radiation weapons that time. Hey, let's group up again, guys. Everyone that was using a radiation weapon, group up for the picture. If you're not using a radiation weapon, just don't have your weapon out. <laughs> I don't know how fast we just did that, but that was super fast. Everyone get in. Just don't have your weapon out if you don't have a radiation weapon. Jeez, there's so many I can't even... I'm gonna have to back up the field of view here. Woo! We got like the whole server here using radiation weapons. So yeah, there's one example. I'll show you another example to further in this video. But to get into how to do this, all you gotta do is just use a weapon that deals out radiation damage. Like for this example, I was using the auto axe with the overly generous perk card in the charisma category. That makes it so you'll deal out radiation with a melee weapon. But you could also use the radium rifle or a gamma gun as well for some other examples. And that will dish out radiation damage too against the robots. For some reason, there's some kind of glitch going on with the radiation damage against the robots. The radiation damage, for some reason, deals out an insane amount of damage to them. It may not seem like you're doing a whole lot of damage with the base damage numbers that pop up, but the radiation damage, for some reason, annihilates the robots. When the radiation starts taking effect on the robots, the health of them just drop, just chunks at a time, <laughs> which isn't supposed to be actually happening. Right now, this is just, you know, a bug or glitch in the game that's going on, which I highly recommend to actually take advantage of this glitch while it is around in the game before Bethesda patches this out because this can earn you a bunch of legendaries, experience, and unique rewards too. Keep in mind Bethesda is going to patch this out eventually. I don't see them keeping this around in the game whatsoever. But yeah, here's another example over this glitch in action while using the Gamma Gun. Check this out. <laughs>
gamma guns out with the robot behind us all with our gamma guns or whatever you got so yeah that's just another example over this radiation damage bug that's going on right now and real quick here at the end in case you don't know how to trigger this new boss fight event all you got to do is just nuke somewhere down in the new map expansion area the skyline valley region you can nuke anywhere down in this area and that will trigger the neurological warfare event which is the event where you fight the new bosses at and yeah it's literally that simple i just wanted to share this information to just help even more players be aware that this is currently going on in the game and it's something that you can take advantage of to reap a lot of rewards once again bethesda will be patching this out though there's no doubt about it the question is though win <laughs> but yeah i'm out of here though everyone consider leaving a like on this video if you did find this enjoyable that's totally up to you though of course just leave a reminder here in the end but yeah as always most importantly thanks for taking the time watching and listening until next time peace